What's up YouTube, it's Adam from I'm a Music Mogul and today I'm going to show you how to get a tremolo piano, sort of like Radiohead. If you heard a couple of their songs on their albums, you kind of hear this tremolo sounding piano. And I'm going to show you how to get that effect right now in Logic Pro. Now basically let's go ahead and play out the chords that I have right here. It is sort of like a Radiohead kind of chords. All right, so that just repeats itself. What I'm gonna do right now is gonna add some flavor to it by adding some tremolo. So the first step we gotta do is select our track and go to our insert section. And I am going to bring in modulation, tremolo, stereo, and bring in my effect plugin from the other window. I'm gonna go ahead and play and change a couple things here. Now what you wanna do here is, I'll actually explain to you a couple things. Your rate is how fast you want your tremolo to be. Your symmetry is, well, how kind of it builds into your actual sound. And actually, I'm going to play with it live so you hear better when I explain it. So here's your rate. So for this kind of sound, you want a 1 16th kind of rate. For your symmetry, you kind of want... Kind of want the smooth into itself. So about there, for your smoothing, you don't want it to be too smooth. You kind of want it to be more jagged. So the lower number it is, the, the less smooth the actual sounding sound will be. It's going to be more jagged. And your phase, as you can hear right now, there's kind of a delay. You don't want a delay to your right side. You kind of want it in the middle. And basically your depth means is sort of, if you think of your depth, you kind of think of it as your mix. So if I lower it, kind of got to mix the two together but we're just going to leave the depth to 100 percent so that is right there i'm going to go ahead and bypass the tremolo plugin on and off so here it is it on here it is off finally on All right, so we're getting there. It sounds kind of good right there. So again, you want your rate to be 1 16th. The higher the rate, the faster that tremolo will be. And your symmetry kind of, and all this kind of things kind of sorts out how smooth you want your sound to be and how jagged you want it to be. So I'm gonna go ahead and close this and I'm gonna go ahead to my send section and go to bus one. Again, in this circle area right here, hold down the option key and kick, sorry, kick, not kick, click in the middle right there and that will send it out at unity gain. So under my bus one right here, I'm actually gonna bring in some distortion to kind of get that more Radiohead sounding sound with some distortion. So I'm gonna go distortion, and I'm gonna go to overdrive. Again, bring in my plugin from the other window. And uh, basically what you wanna do here is obviously drive up the sound a little bit, and you kinda of wanna get that into the 2000 K range, sorry, 2K range. So I'm gonna go about there, just to kind of bring out that sound, that rawness right there in the piano, and then your output, you kind of change as you want. So I'm just gonna play and hear the sounds. So that right there is the sound I'm going for. Now, some of you might say, oh, it sounds like it's distorting, but that's kind of the sound we're going for for this particular case. So I'm going to kind of drive it up a little bit more. And now, basically, I'm just going to go ahead and add in a reverb quickly. So reverb, space designer, stereo, and it's going to be a small one at that, so... Again, bringing the plug in for another one, and I'm going to bring in a small space reverb. What am I going to choose? Okay, let's just use this one. Quick delay. Turn up the reverb to 100% because we are on an auxiliary track. I'm going to go ahead and play. And that is how you get a Radiohead like tremolo piano. So I'm going to go ahead and bypass these plugins I did right here. Here's without the reverb, without the overdrive. 
So as you can see, that overdrive really brings out the sound. And the reverb just kind of softens it up a little bit. And again, that's how you get that tremolo sounding piano in Logic Pro. And I'm actually going to go ahead and save this uh, session right here and upload it so you guys can download it in the more info section to take a look in the in the download link in the more info section under the video if you guys want to go ahead download this and play around with the different settings and other than that if you have other questions on this you can ask me in the comment section and as usual guys more great videos always coming soon so remember to subscribe i'll talk to you soon later